This video will show you how to properly clean and oil a Price AA current meter. The Price AA current meter should be thoroughly cleaned and oiled after each day's use to prevent certain parts from rusting. Some important parts of the current meter include the contact chamber, the yoke of the current meter, the two set screws, the raising nut, the pivot, the pivot set screw, and the wheel hub. When using the current meter, make sure that the wheel hub turns counterclockwise and not clockwise to prevent the whiskers in the contact chamber from breaking. Before dismantling, cleaning, and oiling the current meter, you should have the proper equipment, including a large soft cloth to absorb water, cotton tip swabs for cleaning the bearing surfaces, and the proper sizes of screwdrivers for the pivot set screw and the set screws on the yoke. You should also have a supply of oil. When dismantling the current meter, you must first release the raising nut. The raising nut is released by turning it clockwise. Next, you will release the two set screws in the yoke. Make sure you are using the proper size screwdriver to release the set screws. Once the set screws are released, make sure you have a location that you can easily find the set screws when reassembling the current meter. Next, we will remove the contact chamber from the yoke slowly and carefully. And finally, we will remove the pivot from the yoke. To clean the current meter, we must first clean the pivot bearing. Clean and dry the air pocket and the pivot bearing using a cotton tip swab. Now we will clean the pivot hole also with a cotton tip swab. Then we will clean the shaft with the large soft cloth. Next, we will clean the pivot. Clean the pivot also with the large soft cloth. Wipe the pivot until it's thoroughly dry. Finally, we will clean the contact chamber. Clean the contact chamber also with a cotton tip swab by swabbing it from the bottom. Occasionally, you might want to clean the contact chamber by allowing a forceful stream of hot water. To oil the current meter, we must first oil the shaft. Apply a film of oil onto the shaft and making sure that it goes through the Acme threads. Next we will oil the pivot bearing. Also apply a thin film of oil over all exposed parts of the pivot bearing. Then we will oil the pivot hole. Apply a drop of oil to the sides or the hole through which the pivot passes. And finally, we will apply a thin film of oil to the pivot. To reassemble the Price AA current meter, we will first replace the pivot. Replace the pivot and then tighten the set screws that hold it in place. Then fit the contact chamber over the end of the shaft and into the hole in the arm of the yoke.
match the marks on the contact chamber, and tighten the set screws. And finally, move the wheel hub assembly up and down to determine whether the pivot adjustment is correct. Unless the price of a current meter is to be used immediately, raise a pivot bearing off the pivot by raising the raising nut. If the price of a current meter is to be used immediately, run the spin test to determine the bearing condition. The spin test should last in a minimum of one and a half minutes.